Hello everyone, welcome back to Minecraft. I've been busy. Uh, screw you. As you can see, did a bit more netherite mining. Um, well, I actually improved on the machine itself. So originally, we had just the three segments. And then I upgraded to eight. But then as you can see, it kind of broke. So now we went down to six. And then two more broke. Well, I think it's actually just this one that, well, this one blew up. So now we were down to four. I went a bit further. And then this one blows up because it got stuck. Which is great. Also, the gas are a real problem. But from all of this, which is a massive area. I've got like a stack and a half, and that's really good. I want to see how many blocks we can make, because obviously, you know, I eventually want to maybe get a beacon. You know, if I go at this enough, eventually it will happen. Obviously not for a while, because this will probably get me like eight blocks, maybe nine. But we will have to see. But... For the majority of this video, I want to build a mob farm because we need gunpowder desperately. But let me just stick all this stuff away quick. So this is our current Neverite wares. But let me quickly smelt it. Oh god. Smelt it up. And turn it into ingots. And then we'll see what it is afterwards. Oh wait, I'm dumb. I forgot. Minecraft works. Yeah. I was thinking, how the hell would I have nine blocks of Neverite? But I forgot it's not one inch of debris per ingot when I did the calculation. But hey, that's still decent. I mean, you could technically count this as Neverite. These count as a Neverite ingot. Obviously, these are just from a bastion, which I did actually go through. I think that's how I got some of the netherite. That's from some of the broken farm. I didn't realize I had TNT in there. Anyway, we have to do something. This needs to be locked. It is the 19th, and this was meant to be done on the 17th. Luckily, I haven't built anything. But let me build another one of these and duplicate them. Uh, yeah, just give me, give me a second. And there we go. I have updated the dates. Um, I'm not gonna put a date on it. I'll just do then, and then whenever I'm on, roughly near then, I'll lock it. Now for the main focus, we need to build a. Mob farm. Um, but we don't have like any of the supplies. We need like 15 shulk boxes full of just blocks. I don't think I can even make. I can make seven. Oh. It's fine, we don't need to use shulk boxes for everything. We can just make chests over there. I don't want to use an Everax, so I still want it to look nice, but. Yeah, we also need a ton of glass, which should be easy enough. But I say we get into a time lapse and uh, we harvest some blocks. Let's get to it.
Right. Um, as you can see, it's working pretty well. Um, now I have actually spent the last, well, last night, the, the night after I built it, just AFK. And I built, you know, the basic uh, storage system. It doesn't need anything special. But let us check our wares. Oh. Oh, that's good. That's like, let me think, I finished at about one in the morning. And then I woke up at about... Why well, actually woke up about five to to do stuff, and then I turned off my computer. So that's four hours just there. And we've also got some here. How much? Okay, I imagine this is gonna be very full. Yeah, same with the bones. Uh, it's about the same as a gunpowder, to be honest. Uh, arrows, well, I don't really need arrows. Redstone, nah. I'm surprised we have a stack of bottles, to be honest. Um, but it is very ugly. Um, thankfully, it's like just out of render distance from the base, I think. Let me check. Oh no, you can very much see that. It's fine. I'm sure I'll figure out something to put over that. But for now, we can kind of just stay like that. Because that took way too long. I wonder, is it? Oh no. I need to get a bigger map. Which is just like always updated. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure out some way to make that time lapse shorter. So, if it was quite, like, clunky at times, I apologise. But, there were five players in this thing. Let me see if I can, like, break in. Is there somewhere? Yeah. Well, no, there's six layers, even. So, I sh probably showed the first layer, I imagine. And then the rest is just probably going to be... Either like a super sped up version of the first bit, or like, just the final product. But at least our gunpowder's sorted. Um, I want to see how much we actually have all together. Okay, they're close to a f two full double chests, so if I was to, like, AFK, like, eight hours, it would probably be all four of these chests. I'm so glad we have farms like this now in Bedrock, because when I used to play before, this wasn't a thing. Like, you'd have to AFK for a lot longer, or build like a ghast farm. But then you miss out on like some of the summer stuff. Now, I do want to build a witch farm eventually for redstone, because apparently they have a 100% drop chance now, or they will do soon. Only problem is, I don't think I've seen a witch hut in, like, years. Like, I don't go to swamps that often, but I probably haven't seen a witch hut since, like, one... Point sixteen. Also, the campfires really just break your game sounds. It's very annoying. But I hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, I am technically. Uh, well, I was out of time technically yesterday. I only try and spend a few hours on these videos, but sometimes with these big farms, you can't help it. Um, but it's fine, you know. It's not like this video's got to be out tomorrow. I've technically got another two days to this has to be out. 
but I hope you have enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye now.